U.S. History, Five Most Important Dates April 30th, 1803, the Louisiana Purchase The Louisiana Purchase was the acquisition of the Louisiana Territory by the United States from France in 1803. The U.S. paid France a total of $68 million for this territory. The reason the U.S. got such a favorable deal for this massive amount of land was due to how Napoleon wanted to sell the land as he was in desperate need for money due to him raising a military in preparation for war. In addition to this, Napoleon also wanted to sell the land as it could have created conflict with the U.S. in, fu in the future if he held on to it. With these things in mind, Napoleon sold the territory to the U.S. at the price of less than four cents per acre. Overall, this was a great opportunity for the U.S. that Jefferson capitalized on in order to double the size of the U.S. This led to the start of the ideology of manifest destiny. This is the idea that it is destined by God that the United States will expand its domain and democracy westward across the entire North American continent. This ideology was a big factor in how the U.S. operated in the future and led to the acquisition of the many other westward territories such as the Oregon Territory. January 1st, 1863, the Emancipation Proclamation. The Emancipation Proclamation was the act of abolishing slavery that was put forward by President Abraham Lincoln on January 1st, 1863. This act was put forth one month after the Union won the battle at Antietam in order to declare the South that their views on slavery would no longer be permitted and that from then on all slaves are freed. This changed the focus of the war to not only be for preservation of the Union but also to free the slaves. This ended up being one of the opening acts of civil rights and later led to the civil rights movement in the 1900s because of this action taken by Lincoln. America began to take a turn towards equality and was a turning point that led us where we are today in civil rights. January 1917, the Zimmerman Telegram. The Zimmerman Telegram was a secret diplomatic communication issued by the German Foreign Office in January 1917. This telegram proposed a military alliance between Germany and Mexico in order to get Mexico to declare war on America. The purpose of this alliance was to distract America from entering World War I by pressuring them with Mexico's military. In this alliance between Germany and Mexico, Mexico was promised all the territory that they had lost to the United States previously. This plan eventually backfired on Germany as the message was intercepted by Britain and decoded. Later Britain revealed this to the US which encouraged them to enter the war, therefore bringing America into World War I. The entrance of America into the war turns the tides of the battle towards the Allies' favor, and eventually it led to the Allies winning the war. October 24th, 1945, the United States joins the United Nations. This was implemented in place of the League of Nations due to the League of Nations' lack in efficiency proven by the start of World War II, which the League of Nations was founded to prevent. The establishment of the United Nations was made in order to prevent any other conflicts like World War II from ever happening again. The United Nations was formed by the five permanent members that made up the United Nations Security Council, which included the Republic of China, France, the Soviet Union, the United Kingdom, and the United States. This was a massive step forward for the creation and conservation of world peace and ended up binding many nations together and integrated the U.S. into good relationships with many other countries. July 20th, 1969, the moon landing. The start of the space race was due to how the U.S. felt they fell behind the USSR in science and technology due to the launch of Sputnik and how they would lose control of space. This led to the U.S. putting more resources into the space and weapons program in order to outdo the USSR. The reason the U.S. felt they had to outdo the USSR during this time was because they were in the middle of the Cold War, putting pressure on the U.S. to prove its superiority. In 1969, the U.S. won the space race when Neil Armstrong stepped on the moon on July 20, 1969 and set the U.S. flag down onto the moon. The lasting effects of the space race are still apparent today as the space race led to increase of the importance of math and science and education and led us to acknowledge that we could explore space and discover more about our universe, leading to many technological breakthroughs 
as a result of increased interest in space and science.